Hello ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, this is Magnius and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. So yesterday I didn't upload a video and I'm very sorry about that, but I thought I needed a vacation, felt a little bit under the weather, thought you didn't want to hear me vomit everywhere, stuff like that. So I just went ahead and went to sleep, mia culpa, mia culpa, but I'm back now and we are already in space with our old rocket design with a few modifications. First of all, I remembered landing gear this time. And also, there was a little bit of a difference in the launch stage, but I'll show you that next episode, maybe. So where are we going today? We are incredibly close. Let's see if I can t turn around and show you. We are incredibly close to Kerbal, the sun. So you can probably guess where we're going. We are going to Moho. Well, we're going to attempt to go to Moho. And, well... No one really wanted me to go to Moho, some people wanted me to go to Jewel, but Jewel is like really far away, guys. Like, I don't know if you understand just how far Jewel is from here. So I wanted to go for something a little bit closer. Moho and Eve were my options, but Eve's gravity is stronger than Kerbin's, I believe. So I don't know if my parachute would actually work in the atmosphere and stop me from crashing. So... I decided to go to Moho. I'm pretty sure Moho is much smaller than Eve. It has no atmosphere, but I do have a rocket, so that shouldn't be too big of a problem. Our encounter is only about eh, an hour. Yeah, it's less than an hour, actually. It's like 40 minutes or something like that. So I, uh, if I miss this, that, that really sucks. So we're, we're going to try really hard not to miss this encounter, because that would sort of ruin this entire episode. In fact, let's, let's quick save right now. All right, very good. So if we miss this encounter, no, no problem. We're good. Uh, things to talk about. We've almost reached 160 subscribers. I still haven't done our 100 subscriber special episode, and that's because I sort of want to do a real life video, but in order to do that, I need to do some preparations, write down questions on, on cards or something like that, and uh, probably get my suit cleaned because I want to wear my suit if I'm going to put a video of me on the internet. Oh, and by the way, our ship today is called the Genesis 1. Getting a little biblical in here, not not particularly sure why getting biblical, but just, just because Genesis is a cool word. The beginning. The beginning of our trips to Moho, perhaps. Alright, here we go. So, hopefully, hopefully I'll be able to land on Moho and not die. Uh, I know that their plans for Moho, originally, it's supposed to be sort of a, a Mercury concept, but Mercury and Moho have a quite a few differences. The color is quite different. Moho is sort of a reddish brown, and Mercury is actually sort of a grayish blue, I believe. And, uh... I don't, I don't know if Mercury has an atmosphere or not, I'm going to have to check that, but Moho does not have an atmosphere. Also, originally the concept for Moho was sort of like rocky on the dark side, and sort of like lava, burnt rock, blazing sun radiation craziness on the, the Kerbal side, because Moho is tidally locked to Kerbal, meaning that it doesn't actually rotate relative to Kerbal, it's always facing Kerbal, so alright, very good. But, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure, let's see, how, how much fuel do we have to spend? Oh, oh, that's, that's too much, too much, okay. How far is that, 300? Yeah, that's, that's not bad, that's not bad. How much is that? 3,744. Wow. Well, that's, that's a five minute burn, that's, it's not as bad as some other burns I've done in the past, I guess. Eh, oh well. Let's see, five minutes, so we'll get two minutes, two minutes, thirty seconds in. That'll be okay. I'll probably quick save here as well. I really don't want to mess this up. Alright, let us progress. Two minutes, thirty seconds, maybe four. 2 minutes 35 seconds. Do, 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 do. Ah yes, so our... 
our special Terraria Let's Play that's going to start soon with a collaboration. I'm waiting for its Captain James to come online on Skype because he apparently almost never gets on Skype. And oh wait, that that was bad. I need to find where I need to point. That would be good. There we go. Just on time. Perfect. All right. Let's let's begin our burn. There we go. And now we wait. <laughs> Hello, Moho. Quite a quite a beautiful planet down there. We're with Wilman Kerman today, by the way. Wilman Kerman's sort of freaking out. He he doesn't really know what's going on. I don't blame him. It's okay, Wilman. Don't don't freak out too much. I've got this. I've got this in the bag. So yeah, and things to talk about. The Terraria Let's Play, I really want to do that and soon and give away a copy of Terraria, which I have waiting. But of course, I want to put a video on my channel first so that I can actually, oh, I don't know, have some sort of video showing the actual game that I'm going to be giving away. But in order to do that, Captain James needs to get online on Skype first and we have to work out a schedule where at least Captain James and Gravy, yeah, Gravesy Games and I can be online at the same time. Possibly someone else, if someone else wants to join us. I talked to Gravesy about maybe Wes joining us. Lewis is probably way too busy doing important things like talking to game developers because he's totally awesome and people love him. Uh, I don't, I don't think I know any other people who would be up for a collaboration with a small channel like me. So other, other smallish channels and I will, will get together, do a Terraria thing. I'll give away a Terraria game. It'll be good fun. Hopefully, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I've never recorded Terraria before, but it's a it's a really fun game. I, I bought it for like two dollars and fifty cents, I believe, and it uh it's given me more than sixty hours of entertainment. So I definitely think it's a good game. I think you should all try it out if you haven't already. One of you hopefully will get the game for free from me as soon as we get that let's play going. Uh. Psh other things to talk about. So January is over. It's now officially February, both in my country and in the US. And yeah, so that means that my AdSense earnings are now official and have been saved. And I can now talk about the AdSense earnings for January. If you would like to see that, you should go over to Real Life Magnius, my separate channel, our sister channel, so that you can see me talk about how much money I make, how many more subscribers we got in January, stuff like that. It's really not that much at the moment. I'm going to go ahead and let you know, but Hopefully in the coming months it will increase. It's something that personally I'm I'm looking forward to to actually have that number look. When I tell people how much I make in a month, for them to actually say like, wow, that's that's not bad for just playing video games, something like that. But but as it is, it's it's sort of one of those hilarious things that people are like, oh, you make YouTube videos, how much do you make? Oh, lols, you made three dollars forty three cents your first month. That's that's so much money, Magnus. Well, I'll show them. I'll show them. <laughs> oh my gosh, when is this going to start turning? <laughs> I, I want to stay in Moho, please and thank you. Oh my gosh, we're almost out of fuel. Oh no. Oh, don't tell me we're not going to make it. Oh no, that would be terrible. So I, I did have the Poodle engine. I should have switched out the Poodle engine. Oh no. Oh no, this is terrible. What should I do? Oh, we're we're just gonna we're just gonna try for this anyway. Oh, please let this work. <laughs> I don't have enough fuel. Where is this? Where is this? 390. Yeah, we're we're gonna have to make do with that, guys. Um We may even have to land on the dark side. How much fuel? Oh my gosh, we have no fuel left. Uh Right, wonderful. So this this may be a crash landing, ladies and gentlemen. I I apologize. I I apparently I did not test this beforehand. We do not have enough fuel, probably. Oh god, why? Um whew, Okay, so let's go ahead and spin around and <laughs> we uh will do our best. Fun times, fun times. Oh, well, we'll see where this gets us. We'll see.
Actually, maybe I should just spin... Oh, it's tidally locked. Oh, it's not going to spin around. Uh... Okay, well, in that case, I think... I think I know what I'll do. I think. Oh, this this isn't going to work. I, I really don't have enough fuel. Oh, uh, sigh. No. Lack of fuel. Oh, well. We're going to attempt to land. This This probably isn't going to work. Let's get rid of this, because I don't need this anymore. Oh, what to do? This is sad. This is very sad. Maybe... Maybe if I get out with my little Kerman... Ah, oh, that's that's an idea. Ah, oh, that's that's a good idea. Alright. Maybe, maybe if I can just get as low as I possibly can on here... I can... Oh, oh, maybe, maybe this will work. Maybe, I don't. Is that 80? Oh, we really don't have enough fuel for this. Alright, so let's go around here and see... Even if we can't get all the way down, maybe, just maybe, if the gravity is low enough, I'll jump out with Wilman Kerman and try to fall to the bottom with, uh, with the actual Kerbinaut, which may be hard because I don't have a retrograde marker, but I'm, I'm not afraid to do crazy stuff to try to land on this planet. If we, if we land alive with Wilman, then that's totally, that counts, that counts for me. I would be cool with that. Fifty, sixty. Uh, so little fuel. Why can't I just have like two hundred more? Just two hundred. Oh my god. All right, that's that's about as close as I want to get. Let's spin around. I don't want to be completely in the dark because that would not be good at all. Oh, come on, fuel. Okay, we're we're definitely going to make it to Kerbin, not Kerbin, Moho, but I don't Yeah, we definitely we don't have enough fuel to uh fix this entirely. Oh, Oh man, this this is terrible. Okay, so maybe maybe right about here, I'm going to jump out with my Kerbinaut and <laughs> oh sigh, oh sigh indeed. How how high are we? That's that's not good at all. Okay, uh, I don't want to go to the dark side, so. Oh, this... Should I quick save here? No, I shouldn't. I shouldn't quick save here. I should keep the other quick save. All right, Wilman. <laughs> I'm I'm so sorry, Wilman. I, I really... I didn't think it would come to this. I didn't think it would come to this. Let go. And RCS. And we're leaving... We're leaving it behind. We're leaving... We're leaving this behind. We're going this way. Okay, how... How much can we kill... Our acceleration. Yeah, yeah, you can do this. Go, Kerman, go. We can't, we can't even see how much fuel we have. Okay, 91. <laughs> 90. <laughs> oh, God, this, this is the worst, the worst episode ever. Oh, but, but it may work. We may, we may land in the, uh, in the light side. Maybe, perhaps. I don't. <laughs> Oh, what have I done? I'm so sorry, Wilman. I just want to land on Moho alive. <laughs> alright, alright. This this is okay. This is okay. We c 
as long as this keeps advancing towards here, it'll be okay. I just, I just want to land at least right here. That would be good. Then I just have to worry about, you know, hitting it too hard going down. That's not good at all. I think the thing about Kerbinauts is they can survive quite fast speeds as long as they're going horizontally when they hit the surface. They just like sort of roll forever. But I, I want to have more of a, a real landing where it's it's vertical, which may be a bad idea, actually. Maybe I shouldn't be doing that, but uh, that's that's what I want. I want to have... Should I be saving my fuel for... Yeah, that's that's like half of my fuel. Oh well. As long as I get, like, around here, this looks light enough, right? Right? It looks it looks okay. <laughs> Goodbye, Genesis One. I'm I'm so sorry, Genesis One. <laughs> oh, sigh. This is the absolute worst thing to ever happen in Kerbal Space Program. This would never happen, ladies and gentlemen, in a real space program. You would not jump out of your ship and attempt to land on foot. But this is Kerbal Space Program. Anything is possible. <laughs> oh my goodness. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is that is not what I wanted to do. Is that is that okay? I don't... It doesn't look okay. Oh my gosh, we are going so fast. Okay, let's, let's see if I can slow myself down. I am going way too fast. Oh dear god, there's there's like no way. There's no way I'm going to survive this. And I don't have enough fuel. Uh, <laughs> I am so sorry, Wilman. You, you don't deserve this, Wilman. 17% fuel. Oh dear god, what have I done? What have I done? Maybe I should have just tried to land on the dark side. It's probably what I should have done. Okay, so if this doesn't work in our next episode, I'm going to record a second episode tonight, maybe. And we're going to try to do this a second time from our quick save. Oh, no. This this is this is not good. Goodbye, woman, Kerman. You, you are completely out of fuel. Well, at least he's smiling, guys. He's he's gonna go out smiling. Can I actually... Can I finish? Can I... Can I do the quick save? Can I do a quick load after I've already hit the surface? I'm not even really sure of that. Um... So just in case I can't do that, I'm gonna stop this episode now, here. And then I'm gonna do a quick load, alright? So thank you so much for watching this episode. This is Magnius. Watch the next episode to see if we can actually do this correctly using a quick load. And we'll... Oh my gosh, my, my debris. We'll try very hard not to kill Wilman Kerman. So thank you so much for watching. This is Magnius, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>